The surge from the Delta variant, not just pushing new cases up, but we're also seeing record hospitalizations in Oregon. In the last hour, the state announced a new record high, 665 people in the hospital with COVID. That's up 50% from just last week. It's up 445% compared to just four weeks ago. ICU patients are also at record levels, up more than five times the number of patients in the ICU from four weeks ago. So to try and push down those cases, masks will soon be required statewide once again here in Oregon. The governor's new order starts this Friday. Our Lisa Balick was in on the governor's news conference earlier today. She joins us live now from downtown Portland. And Lisa, what did you find out? Well, the governor called shocking. That's what she called the latest case count numbers, especially with Oregon now on the edge of running out of hospital beds, 90% full across the state, and the situation is expected to get worse. That's why she's put this mask mandate in place across the state. Anybody age five and up will have to wear a mask inside a public place, even if you are vaccinated. Now, the governor blames the highly contagious Delta variant for increasing the COVID numbers so quickly, mostly in those who are unvaccinated. Now, even though more than 70% of Oregon adults are fully vaccinated, they can still be carriers and spread the virus. Remember, there's still tens of thousands who are not vaccinated, including children, and that Delta spreads three times as fast as the original version. Without safety measures, we could be as many as 500 staffed hospital beds short of what we need to treat patients by September. And that's patients coming into the hospital for any reason, COVID, a heart attack, or a car accident. Now, Oregon, by the way, is the third state to reinstate a mask mandate. Hawaii and Louisiana also have it. Now, there's no end date right now to lift the mask mandate. It could be months, with doctors saying the COVID surge here may peak the beginning of September. But health leaders tell us today if 80% of people wear the mask, it will push down the COVID cases significantly and avoid virus spread. Now, I asked the governor if this doesn't work. Is she looking at perhaps requiring proof of vaccine, a vaccination card, if you go into public places? She said, we are not there just yet. Also, I asked her, do you have any regret about reopening back in June? You'll hear her answer coming up today at 5. Live in downtown Portland, Lisa Balick, Coin 6 News.